Sink or swim. One, two, one, two. That's it, you got it. Now faster. One, two. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Bite the dust. That's what I say. Marvelous. Now, we shouldn't get ahead of ourselves, but I'm pleased to see they're using moves from the game. Did you hear that? Someone's listening at the door. It's Dillock. Can't you replace him? Oops, wrong door. You'd be surprised how often Dillock proves useful to us. Be patient with him. You won't regret it. Dylan's been so distracted, he didn't recharge Z. Ryan's avoiding his homework. It's that new video game they got. They won't put it down. Yeah. Anyway, that's why we're here, right? We picked a beautiful day. The kids are gonna love it. Hey, where are they? They must be exploring the park. I'll go find them. <laughs> be careful not to burn anything while I'm gone. Wait, who, me? Zero? <sighs> I really hope everything's okay. No answer. Huh? I really think we should talk to Limo and Franklin about this. Why are we using moves from a game? What's the big deal? Who cares? It just proves you can learn cool things from games. This just in. Why has a good point. Your new skills have proven useful. That might be true, but I don't trust the video game. Didn't a stranger give it to them? You just don't want them to have any fun. You know, Ryan will be mad at you if Franklin takes the game away. Really mad. Z, what do you think about this? It's like Dylan doesn't even know me anymore. Okay, take it easy. What's the matter, Z? Oh, uh, hi, Dr. Char. Z's fine. It's nothing, really. Did you see where your pilots went? Uh, I'm uh, pretty sure they went in that direction. Thanks a lot. X? Something wrong? Well, there is one thing. Yeah, he just hopes you have the best picnic ever. <laughs> That's nice. I'll get the kids. Cut it out, will ya? There you are. You'll be happy to know Limo and I have perfected our barbecue skills. It's time to eat. Hmm. Huh? In a sec. Hey, kids. Put the games down and come and eat. Guys, he's talking to you. That's it. From now on, no more games. What? what? Why? Why? You've taken it way too far. Not, Not true. true. No whining, you kids. Dolly, you skipped field hockey. Mom, the field's closed. It's all covered in fertilizer. Practice is canceled all week. Is it? Franklin? She's telling the truth. So that's what I smell driving by. Ooh, what a stench. But still, it's no excuse for the way you've been acting. You haven't listened to anything I've said for days. Huh? Uh, what? We're sorry. We have been spending too much time playing the game, but we'll do better. Speak for yourself. And I was hoping maybe you could give us a second chance to prove it. What do you have in mind? Because I'm running out of patience with your behavior. You know how you're always saying that self-control is the key to success? Well, I think I finally get it. Too much gaming's bad for us. Huh. What I'm hearing is they want to break the habit. Well, it does seem like you've given this a lot of thought. Self-control is an important thing to practice. So we could still play, but maybe for less time? Yeah, let's set a limit. That works, right? Okay, how much time are you thinking? Let's say, just five hours a day. Nice try. I knew that was pushing it. How about an hour? We could make that work? 30 minutes. But, Dad, that's not enough time. Take it or leave it. It takes me three it's tries to be better than nothing. I could get faster. 30 minutes isn't very much. Maybe we should give them a little bit no, longer? No, 30 minutes is just fine. Well, what if they go over the limit? That one's easy. I'll take their game consoles away. Hmm... Does that sound all right, Mrs. Park? What? Yes, of course. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out this new game app. Everyone in my spin and swizzle class is talking about it. Okay, 30 minutes a day it is. Do I have your word? Yes. yes. Hang on. 
Neon still gets to play whenever he wants. Now, how is that fair? Did I hear my name? Talking about my high score? You too. 30 minutes. <sighs> I don't know what else to do with myself. It's not the end of the world. You sure about that? We can't. We made a promise to Dad. I totally agree. We can't risk it. I want to play more, too, but we'll lose our privileges. Uh, this is the worst day ever. Let's ask for our noodles extra spicy. It might wake us up a little. Bet I can do spicier than Corey. Hey, Layla! Okay, here you go. Extra spicy. Think you can handle it? Has anyone tried this? Now that you mention it, just you guys. And those two over Aww. there. Uh, hmm. Next time, can we just order mild? Or maybe, could I pack a sandwich? Time to toughen up and get used to discomfort. I take every opportunity to grow stronger. Not even my taste buds are weak. You should be more like me. Senor, I can't help it. My stomach hurts. Mind over matter. Wait, why do you keep gulping down that drink? This? It cools the spice right down. What? But that is cheating. You didn't give me any. Here. Oh, thank you. It seems their playing time has diminished. I assume that Limo and Dr. Cha have decided to intervene, yes? Hmm. I wouldn't expect any less from those two. Don't worry. Like I said, I have a plan. Yes. Well... Perhaps it's time you explained. What is this special plan? We'll send Franklin and Limo away. With an offer they can't resist. Tomon! X! C! D! Delta Tron Integrate! Look at that. Hm. Great job. You two have outdone yourselves. I am the all-powerful Delta Tron. Pretty cool, don't you think? Yeah. Uh, good for you. Nice work, Dad. You may not be part of this one, but don't be upset, Corey. Listen, your job is also important. You'll support Delta Tron from the no, air. No, it's fine. I'm not upset. We're all seriously impressed, right? Wow, that's oh, great. Yeah. That was weird. The kids weren't excited at all. Time yeah. to feed puppy bot. I'll be back in a moment. Yeah, maybe we need a flash of your paint job. Limo, the paint's not important. Don't be silly. Yeah, yeah, I guess you're right. Hmm. Limo mostly reads engineering papers. Not surprising. And Franklin's been researching video games. Indeed. And Dr. No, he seems to be quite the wild card. True. I've cross-referenced their database searches. It gives us a good idea of where their main interests overlap. Just like I thought, it's all robotics related. I see. Engineers and academics. These are the big innovators whose talks they follow. They all admire this person right here. Who is she? She's a mechanical engineer. It's been over 10 years since she last agreed to speak at a conference. I have no doubt our Tobot inventors would be very excited to meet her in person. Quite ingenious. Thank you. I'm going to invite them to a fake science conference with a lineup of speakers they won't be able to resist. They'll take the bait and leave town for a few days. And that's our opening. And while they're away, the pilots will revert to playing their games more frequently. But when they find out they were tricked... They'll have trouble getting home. They're going to a remote island. It's not like they can swim back. Thanks for looking after them. <laughs> I'm sure there'll be no trouble. Enjoy yourselves and have a nice trip. Neon, you'll help Mrs. Park keep an eye on things? Sure. You guys can count on me. Have lots of fun at the Bring conference. Bring us souvenirs! Dad. Will do. See you in a few days. Mm. Remember, 30 minutes only. We know. Don't worry. Dad, do you mind if we don't eat your casserole? That smells normal. A dessert island? No, a desert island, see? There's absolutely no one else there. Oh, wow. They're so far away. I don't... 
I don't get it. Why go all that way for nothing? Wait, uh, this was Angela's idea, wasn't it? Perhaps, possibly. We need someone respectable, uh, uh, who we can trust to pull this off. Do I get a disguise? Yes. <laughs> all right. Dancing, crime, spying. If you've got a job with a costume, I'm in. And this is no small role. You see, you're a sea captain steering a ferry. What? <gasps> no! <laughs> this way. No back. Told you. Turn around. Uh oh. Look. Hurry. Behind you. Ah, oh, you lost. So, uh, can I have a turn? Just one more round. I see. So you're already breaking your promise. You know you've been playing for more than 30 minutes, right? Really? Guys, quit out. We're past 30 minutes. Already? Huh. It seems shorter. Hey, let's just use tomorrow's time. Nothing wrong with that. The pilots have increased their playing time. And they're playing for even longer than before. Well done. Moving on. Mr. Towers, I'm afraid he's returned. It's essential we speed up our plan. Of course it is. No more one-on-ones, only group battles. <laughs> Everything's falling into place. Good. By the way, I'll be out of town for a bit. Where are you going? And what's in the case? I might have overpacked. It's been so long since I traveled. Hmm. Huh. This thing could come in handy. I wish I'd thought to bring mine. Wait here, Zero. We have an ocean voyage ahead. Question. On this ferry, is there room for me? Hmm. Just foot passengers. I think it's a small boat. It's only a few days. Don't worry. Processed. I will try not to worry. Did you bring extra notebooks? Yeah. I can't wait to hear the speakers. Oh. <sighs> Come on! Oh, man! Uh. Oh, I can't believe how tough Tyrant 2 is. I know! Hang on. Remember how we beat him last time? We did it together, didn't we? Yeah, exactly! We just have to work as a team. But how do we do that? Hmm. I think I know. <laughs> You're welcome. It's around here somewhere. Tired? I know I am. Oh, don't worry about me. <laughs> I'm in a hiking club. It's a way to get a break from the computer screens. Once a week, we climb a hill. Then afterward, we always get some delicious sandwiches. I'll admit, I usually skip the whole hill part. But that saunter down to the sandwich shop keeps me in great shape. Look who it is! Wow, I didn't expect to see you here. So you're going to a conference? <laughs> oh, if we find the boat. You're sure it isn't back over at the main terminal? No, I double-checked. From what I hear, the island's beautiful. Hmm. I've never heard of it. Are you sure you got the name of the island right? Yeah, it's on the brochure. And I've got the ferry tickets right here. Maybe you could join us for the day. Nice thought. <laughs> but I'm on duty another few hours. Oh. <laughs> what do you know? Okay, have Goodbye. fun. Don't worry, we always do. Is that our boat? Huh. Officer O here. I'm on patrol at the marina, and I'm wondering if you could do a bit of online research for me. Well, we did it, guys. To, to us! us. <laughs> By the way, How'd you figure out that we could connect our consoles? It's called reading the manual. Oh, nice one, Dolly. <laughs> Thanks, Dylan. Huh? Oh, 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 oh. Yo ho ho to the island we go. Avast me, hearty passengers, shiver me timbers! Aboard! Be welcome! Sorry, is this a tourist attraction, or...? 
I'm but a simple fairy captain on a fine treasure ship, me matey. There she blows in a yo-ho haste. Step aboard and be swept away. <laughs> no, thank you. Uh, limo, I think we should leave. Something just isn't right about this. Come on. But I already booked the tickets. Let's cancel and find another boat. This uh, way, pardon Professor. Pardon me, mateys. Where are you going? Oh, 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 boss, careful! Oh, Don't rock the boat! Hey! Oh. Oh. You better watch out, Professor. There's a pirate stuck to you. Go, Joe, boss!